champ is here with just one more sleep until you come back here to the Co-op Arena and receive that crowd adoration again. How was that? How was the energy? Um, just, it just keeps motivating me, you know, like, I'm motivated enough with going out there and just hearing the chair and hearing the, uh, I'm excited, I'm excited to go out there and perform tomorrow night. And hear them cheering for you and Bilal getting the booze that he did. The way the face-off went down, do you feel like he's getting agitated by that? Yeah, 100%. You can tell how much he's reacting to the crowd. And that's exactly how he fights. If they touch him, he reacts straight away, you know, so that's the reason why Billy, I'm not I'm knocking him out this fight. You've said that a number of times now. After the last performance against Colby, is a is a finish what you're going for? Just to just settle settle that score, put a full stop on the fact, you know, you fought one another before on the way it ended. Um yeah, hundred percent. I feel like I said, I feel I've been saying it, I feel like it's tailor made for me the way he fights, you know, and um, I truly believe I need to finish this fight for me, my personal thing, but um, yeah, it, I'm, I'm taking them out and that's it. When was the shift from just obviously defending your belt to now it's about greatness, it's about GSP's record and Bilal just being another person in your way? When did that mindset shift towards that I'm now going to be the best ever? Um, I think after my, my defense against Usman, um, I feel like what, what, what was my motivation now and um, what got me to the belt was me chasing the belt, you know, so once I got there, I was okay, what, what, what is it now that's keeping you going? And I, I, want, I want to be known as the best of all time, you know, and I, I think that's GSP right now, and I got a few more I need to come, need to do. And um, he's just another guy in my way. He's taking it personal, saying he hates me, and I, I don't know where, where, where he's getting that from, but it is what it is, whether he needs to motivate himself, it is what it is. And for me, it's just another night, um, another opponent, another guy on the way for me chasing greatness, and that's it. And with all the, the noise and the adoration here, to now have to wait until very late or early hours of tomorrow morning or Sunday morning, how do you then just bring that adrenaline down? What do you do personally to sort of like manage the, the waves that, that come as you get excited um, towards well, the Tonight I've got like a chef at the house, so I'll probably get like all, the, all my friends coming around, family, everyone, um, have some food, have, have just have banter, and try to make it as, as light as possible. You know, like, obviously, it's always in the back of your head, the fight, but you got to keep it make it as normal as possible to, to go out and be free and perform you know I feel like when you're tense and you over, you overthinks it you, you're kind of like freezing there and I'm, I'm relaxed and ready to go you know. Does it put more or less pressure on you than having the family around you? Is your son going to be there as well? Um, what to the fight? Yeah. Uh, no I don't, I, don't, I don't believe kids should come to the right. fight you know yeah. Um, but yeah my son won't be there but all my, all my friends and family everyone else will be there and um, yeah it's going to be I can't wait I can't wait. Right. Seems like you're in great spirits. We can't wait to watch you go out there and, and look to defend your belt once again. Thank you. Enjoy the next 24 hours. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you. Good luck.